Hey what's up guys this is Vimal here and welcome back to another video on my channel. So in today's video I've got something special to show you all. You can see we've got a huge box over here. Now this special package was sent to us by ASUS. Now this is something very different guys. I have never done something like this in the past. So this particular product is made specially for big companies, enterprises and organizations you know. These companies have a lot of online meetings and video conference sessions right in their companies and for that purpose these companies don't have a proper setup at their office. You know, so they can bring a lot of participants from different parts in the world to a single conference call. And for that purpose, ASUS in collaboration with Google has designed this particular device called as Hangouts Meet Hardware Kit. You know Hangouts Meet, right? We use it a lot on our smartphones for video callings and online meetings. This particular hardware brings the same video calling Hangouts experience to a conference room in your office. So yes, you heard me right. This is what that does. Now video communication is a new trend, guys. A lot of multinational companies are opting for video conference calls and online meetings. So this particular Hangout Meet hardware kit comes with a lot of items in it. Uh, it's got a mini computer called as Asus Chromebox 3. It's like a mini PC which is powered by Chrome OS. Along with that video calling definitely needs a camera right. So, so they also bundle a 4K camera along with that in the package. And there's also a high quality speaker mic unit in the box. So in this video what I'll do is I'll unbox it. I'll show you how to install this in your office and also give you a full demo on how it works. So let's get started with the video. So the ASUS Hangouts Meet Hardware Kit comes with this sort of box packing. It's a huge box and the package feels really heavy. You've got the ASUS branding on it and says Hangouts Meet Hardware on the front. Ok going to the top we've got the Intel logo. It's a simple box guys there's nothing much written on it. So let's get started with the unboxing. And also guys I'll be doing this very quickly because looks like we've got a lot of stuff inside this box and I don't wanna waste any time over here. Alright let's get started. So at the top we've got the ASUS Chromebox 3, let me take it out. It's a mini PC powered by Intel and runs on Chrome OS. Along with that you get a 10.1 inch touchscreen, a high quality speaker mic and a 4K UHD camera. So these were the 4 main items we got in the package. Now let me show them to you one by one. First let's start with the Chromebox. So this is the ASUS Chromebox 3. It's a powerful mini PC which brings desktop level experience in such a small and compact form factor. It runs on Chrome OS, has built in Google Play Store and is powered by Intel's 8th gen CPUs. And along with the Chromebox you get a lot of accessories like there's a power adapter, a lot of different cables for setup and installation purpose. You also have some paperwork here, make sure to read them for all the info on the product. So let me give you an overview on the Chromebox 3. At the top there's a sticker over here with the ASUS branding at the center and has a layout that shows you how to connect all the provided peripherals to it. So let's see what all ports do we have on it. On the front we've got an Intel sticker. This Chromebox 3 comes in different variants. The one I have is powered by i7-8550U quad core CPU which is clocked at 4GHz. Coming to the ports we've got a 3.5mm audio jack, two USB 3.1 ports and a micro SD card slot. Going to the right there's nothing over here and looks like we've got a lot of ports at the back side. We've got an RJ45 LAN port, 3 more USB 3.1 ports, a HDMI port, a DC in port and a USB 3.1 Type-C port. On the left side there's a reset button and a Kensington lock. And this is how the bottom part looks like. We've got 4 rubber foot pads, some info regarding the chrome box and a lot of vents to let the heat escape. So that was our complete look on the Chrome Box 3 from ASUS. Now let me also show you the other items we got in the package. Video calling definitely needs a camera right? So they also provided a high quality camera in the package. It's a 4K camera that offers 120 degrees super wide field of view. This camera is great for video calling. The company says it can easily cover up to a range of 250 square feet. Also it's not just any other camera, it's a smart camera that can automatically detect active participants and intelligently zooms and frames the video around the subject. You just need to connect it to the Chrome box with a Type-C cable and you're good to go. And this is how the speaker mic unit looks like. It's a very high quality speaker mic unit custom designed by Google. It features advanced echo cancellation and noise suppression technology to deliver rich, immersive and crystal clear 360 degree sound. All these buttons on it are touch buttons and there's a huge speaker grill at the top. There's nothing much on the sides and going to the bottom you've got all the connectivity ports. If you're using only one of these in your setup then no external power is required. Just connect it to your chrome box and you're good to go. 
And this is the final thing we got in the package. It's a 10.1 inch touchscreen control panel. It's made by Mimo monitors and the model is View HD captures. It's a capacitive touchscreen monitor for the Hangouts Meet setup. Now guys, this monitor not only works with Chromebox, but you can even use it for your PC as well as Mac systems. Let me unbox it and show you. So we've got a lot of stuff in the box, like we've got connectivity cables, a dock type stand, and here is the monitor. It's a 10.1 inch capacitive touchscreen. The build quality looks good and it's also not that heavy. Now setting it up is very simple, I'll show you that at a later part in the video. And this is the stand I was talking about. It's a dock type stand, entirely made of metal and feels super heavy in the hand. So these are all the items you got in the package. Now what I'll do is I'll quickly show you how to set up this entire Hangouts Meet hardware kit step by step. It's a very easy process and you can do it in less than 5 minutes. All the instructions are there in the manual guys so there is no need to get confused anywhere. First let's connect the touch screen panel to the chrome box. Now coming to the monitor cables, you need to connect 3 cables to it marked with different colors, green, blue and red. All of these are provided in the box itself. You should connect this green HDMI cable to the HDMI port on the chrome box 3. The blue one is a USB cable to recognize the touch input. And finally the red cable is for the power, which should be connected to the provided power adapter. So connect all these 3 cables to the chrome box like how I am doing in this video. And that's it, we are done with the monitor wiring. Now that we are done with the touchscreen part, it's time to connect the camera. Connecting the camera is also very simple, there's only one cable for that. You just need to connect a USB Type-C cable from the chrome box to this camera. And it's all ready to be used. The camera stand is also fully adjustable, you can tilt it like this and set it to whichever angle desired. Now the final thing you need to connect is the speaker mic unit. Since we are using only one of these, the connection is very simple. You don't even need to connect any sort of power supply. You just need to connect a micro USB cable from the speaker mic unit to the USB 3.1 port on the chrome box, just like this. If you want to use more than one of these, then you can easily daisy chain multiple speaker mics to extend the coverage for large conference rooms. So that was the complete installation procedure. I could set up this whole system in less than 5 minutes. Now let me power it on and show you all the features of this chrome box. So during the setup process, you can configure this chrome box to use it as a mini PC with Chrome OS or configure it only for Hangouts Meet mode. The choice is up to you. I'll give you guys a brief overview on Chrome OS and also show you all of its features. So this is how the setup looks like. The Chrome Box 3 is powered by Intel's i7-8550U quad-core CPU, has Intel HD Graphics 620, comes with 4 gigs of DDR4 RAM, 32 GB of onboard M.2 SSD and runs on Chrome OS. So this is how the interface looks like. We've got a 10.1 inch capacitive touchscreen that works very well. The display's angle is also adjustable, you can easily tilt it and set it to the desired position, just like this. As you can see, the touch response is good and it accurately detects my gestures. If you've used Chromebox in the past, you'll be very familiar with the UI. It's got a simple and clean interface and feels very much like Android. So let me just show you the UI and tell you about the performance. The UI feels responsive, the transitions are smooth and the device feels really snappy. It's powered by Intel's 8th gen i7 quad core CPU, so you can definitely expect good performance from it. It also has a fully functional Google Play Store on it, so you can download any sort of apps or games very easily from the store. I've tested a lot of apps on it, faced no issues so far. For video calling purpose, it's more than enough. Plus, it's also touchscreen, so by a single touch you can easily join any video meetings on Hangouts. Also guys, it's not compulsory that you should use only this display with the chrome box. You can connect any monitor or TV screen to the chrome box using a HDMI cable. And talking about the sound quality from the speaker unit, the audio quality was very good. It was crisp and clear, you could clearly understand the dialogues with minimum distortion and the audio output was also loud and satisfactory. Now let me tell you the main purpose of this complete setup. This Hangouts Meet Kit was designed to let you have meetings or video calls with any person on any sort of device from anywhere in the world, all possible through Google's Hangout Meet platform. The meetings on it support up to 50 participants and anybody can easily join using a simple shareable link. Alright guys, now let me finally give you a demo on how this setup works with the help of Hangouts Meet. As you can see, I've already loaded up Hangouts Meet on the Chromebox 3. You can see the video on the display. The camera is over here, we are getting a live preview on the display. And we are right now in indoor lighting conditions, I haven't put any sort of light. And the video quality looks very good even in indoors. Uh, talking about the latency and all those lags, I don't see any sort of lag. As you can see, the video looks very smooth and in real time. 
So what I'll do is, uh, we, uh, we haven't started any meeting over here. I'll just uh, invite some participants and give you a demo on how this thing works. All right guys, so I've set up an online video meeting right now using this hardware kit. And as you can see, instead of that provided Nemo touchscreen, what I've done is I've connected my computer screen to the Chrome box. And instead of this computer screen, you can connect any sort of uh, monitor or even your TV screen would be perfect. You can use anything. So right now in this conference call, we are having my sister online. I've called her up to test this conference video call. And yeah, talking about the video quality, you can have a preview of the camera over here. We are checking out ourselves. The camera quality looks pretty good even in indoor lighting conditions. I haven't used any sort of light you can see in the video. Okay, so let me show you the part dispense video quality. So like this, you can have a conference call with anybody. Hi, Sheetal. Hi. So what's up? What are you doing? Nothing, what are you doing? So what am I doing is, I'm actually testing this new product from Asus. It's called Hangouts Mate Hardware Kit. So what it actually does is, it lets you have online video meeting, you know, like a conference call with up to 50 participants at a time. Sounds cool, right? Yeah. So what do you think about the video quality? The video quality is nice. It's nice, right? You can see me clearly, right? Yeah. And what about the audio? Audio is also clear. So guys, as you can see, the speaker mic unit is also very nice. The sound is coming very clearly. No matter where you place it in your room, you can easily hear the sound coming from it. And also the mic on it is very good. You can easily talk to that and the person on the other side can hear you clearly. So like this, you can have an online video conference with up to 50 participants at a time. That is awesome, right? You can easily switch between the participants by selecting the person from over there. So yeah, that was it, Sheetal. Thanks for the quick video test. Bye. Bye. It's great for companies and enterprises and is a perfect solution for online meetings, interviews or any sort of discussions. So that was my video on Asus Hangout Meets Hardware Kit. This thing is mainly made for large companies and enterprises. I like the idea, it does the job and felt it's great for business people who frequently arrange meetings and discussions with their teams. Coming to the pricing details, it's a premium product guys and if you're interested in buying it, I'll leave all the info in the description box below, you can check it out there. So that was it for today, thanks for watching my video, hope you all liked it and got to see something new. Make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more new awesome videos and I'll see you in the next one.